Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is uh, LA for Show 23. Coming back today with uh, my Penny Collection uh, update vid. I've been waiting on doing for quite some time. I've been collecting and um, and whatnot, and uh, I just wanted to give an overview on the full collection that I've finally finally completed. Um, to my concern, as far as the shoes go. Um, one through five, the uh, little penny models, and a couple other little uh, uh, collectibles that I picked up along the way, and uh, I got a custom item that I need to review and give a shout out to um, the person that made it, and then I'll do a couple, like a recap of the last video I did, just real quick, and then a couple pickups before I get into the penny stuff. So, um, you know, your boy Penny. I'm rocking LA because my initials are LA. If you always wonder why I wear LA hats and whatnot. Um, and again, we're in the retro room. Let's give you a quick, a quick uh, glimpse around. I'm into, uh, like, if you've never seen my vids before, I'm into um, obviously Jordan's um, stuff that's come out within my, uh, you know, my timeline of growing up. <clears throat> um, so I kind of. I call this retro room because it's kind of like things from my past and whatnot, and uh, just stuff that um, I've accumulated over the years. And so, just a quick little glimpse around. So yeah. So first off, um, last video, just real quick, um, I reviewed my uh, son's baby sixes, Lakers sixes. I had bronzed. Um, just trying to. I try to do different things, um, try to be different about everything that I do. Uh, my collection is based on things that um, uh, may not be in other, like, you know, current shoes that are released. Um, no hype stuff, really. Just things that I'm into and um, whatnot. So um, these are my son's first shoes that he walked in. I had them bronzed and uh, maybe something that you might want to get done um, the company that did it was American Bronzing so just wanted to touch on that real quick um, here's one pickup that I just made uh, found the other day just driving around when I was working I do cable for a living for us so I got a lot of downtime and I just happened to swing by this garage sale this is a mirror and it is the Bulls when they won the six championships um, thought this thing was just sick like you see the gold leaf it's kind of hard because I got that light on. I can't turn it off, but you can see the speckles in the in the gold there. This thing is really sweet. I picked that up for 40 bucks. I couldn't couldn't pass it up. Didn't get a chance to mount it yet. So, um, and then one other real quick pickup. <clears throat> you see your boy uh, Fred Sanford back there, the original Pawn Star, and I found these Pippins on eBay. Uh, these are chocolate leather. You see that leather, that full grain leather, tumbled. I mean, it's buttery like a freaking cowboy boot. Uh, these are just, these are just ridiculous. I picked these up for like a hundred bucks shipped, um, just sitting on eBay. I don't have any Pippins, but these were my size and everything. And he said they were worn once, but I can't tell. They look brand new, so I picked them up. I uh, thought that was a nice little pickup. And then uh, I need to give a huge shout out to EJM1's work. Um, if you can find him on Instagram, I'll try to put a link in the description. Um, this is a jacket that he he makes. This is called Sublimation. He basically, I think it's something they do, I don't know, something to do with water. I don't know how they uh, screen print these on these jackets, but... These are all his, um, this is the first jacket that I got from him at a sneaker show in Detroit. And I uh, tracked him down on Instagram because it took me a minute to find him. And uh, I contracted out a jacket for the Penny Collection. And I guess I'll show you that now. So again, his uh, Instagram is EJM1, EJM1's work. So if you look that up, I'll, I'll try to put the... The full name in the description so you can look him up because he does like crazy work i got a lot of compliments on this jordan jacket in chicago 
and without further ado this is the penny jacket he made for me and I you know gave him the instructions on how I wanted it I wanted it just like the jersey the Orlando jersey and then I also wanted it like the Jordan jacket that he made me how there's Jordan everywhere and he put penny everywhere on this jacket for me um, I'm really happy with how it came out. I mean, he, I know I'm kind of picky on how I want things, and uh, he uh, worked with me. You know, we conversated on the phone. I explained to him what I wanted, and uh, he did a phenomenal job. So a uh, huge shout-out to uh, his name's Evan. So if you contact him and want something done, he'll probably get an email from him, and that's the name that will pop up. And uh, he, did a, he did a great job, though, uh, EJM1. EJM1's work on Instagram and EJM1 Sportswear. He's got two Instagram channels uh, pages, so so that's that's that. So I wanted to give a big shout out to him for making that happen for me, so now I can rock that with my pennies. And without further ado, I'll get into a quick overview of the penny collection. Um, first, real quick, got this Soul Collector magazine with penny. Um, in there they talk about all his kicks um, somewhere in there there's an interview with him and uh, yeah there's a little there's a little penny right there so yeah so there's the soul collector or the soul yeah soul collector magazine here's a little penny right here it's my Orlando fitted I don't know why it's a Reebok one, but so and here's that box, that PlayStation 4 box. And everybody knows what's inside here. But maybe you don't if you haven't seen my last video. Because bam! I made this my little penny, my little penny collection. Instead of the uh phone posits, I didn't purchase those. I was able to pick up the box, the little penny posit. And I did that on purpose because I wanted to put my half cent, um, my royal half cents in here. So I got the little penny posit collection instead of, I didn't want the white foams. And you can look at my last, in one of my last videos and hear about all that. So that's my little penny collection. And then down here, I got the color wheel. This has been sitting down here for like over a month since I posted this on Instagram. If you want to follow me on Instagram, it's LA for show 23. Um, that's on my Instagram page, but, uh, I've been, this has been sitting here. I just have not had time because my son and it's just been crazy. We've had the in-laws here for 4th of July. I just have not had time to shoot the video, but this is the full Orlando colorway penny collection. I finally completed. So you got your ones, your twos, your threes, your fours, your fives, and you go into the foams and I've got rid of my uh, red foams sold those picked up the little penny posits picked up the royals finally got the royals ds and you got the little penny um half cents little penny posits zoom rookies binary blues orlando colorway um man i knew i was gonna lose track of the names that one is the that one is the Ergo LWP, and then you got the Air Flight Ones. These are the ones Jordan wore, um, and he cut the one off the back. These are the rookies that came out, the All Star ones that were hard to find. Got them from ZX. Got these from ZX in a package deal. Shout out to him for that. Um, sorry if the camera turned on me. <sighs> then we got the. Uh, Air Ups, Nike Air Ups. These are like the newest version. So that's my one through five penny collection with the rookie shoes that he wore, the foams and whatnot, half cents, little penny collection. And then over here, just real quick, I got the uh, got the New York Nick version. 
And I got the, I guess this is Memphis, when he played on Memphis. I guess that's why he always has, like, black and red shoes or whatever. But these are the first ones I picked up. And then I finally was able to track down the, uh, the Orlando colorway of the LWP. So, and then real quick, <laughs> these are a pair of shorts I bought off eBay. And they ended up being some bootleg shorts. But I should have known by the price. But if anyone knows where I can get a legit pair of Orlando, you know, the old school shorts. Uh, a giveaway is the uh, symbol is black and not blue right there. I mean, these look like official Nike shorts, but there's no other tagging right here that tells you how to wash it and whatnot. So, but, yeah, I mean, they just feel a little snug, but... But, uh, anyway, that's pretty much just a quick overview. Um, over here, I just got all the boxes. I got them all pictured and everything. Um, those are Jason kids, obviously, but, but yeah, so finally got the, uh, Penny Collection put together all the way. There's your boy Shaq. But, um, yeah, other than that, I just wanted to get this video finally out there. I know it's a little bit longer. I had a lot of things to touch on, but, uh. Uh, LA Show 23. Check out some of my older vids if you haven't, and uh, if you first time you if you're watching for the first time and whatnot. And uh, yeah, um, Instagram LA Show 23. And other than that, um, Penny Collection video. Finn, holla at you later. Deuces.